Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I'm going to show you how I achieved this look using the latest collection between Florasis and Susan Fong. Today I'm going to be presenting you the newest collection from Florasis. You are the pearl of my eyes, which is a collaboration with the designer Susan Fang. Inspired by the romantic season of the Chinese Valentines and this video, it is in partnership with Florasis. Thank you so much to Florasis for once again partnering up with me, having the trust and the confidence to showcase their products that honestly, my friends, I'm just super, super excited. As you can tell, I already have foundation concealer on. I also did my brows off camera using the Florasis brow pencil that you know it's one of my favorite brow pencils. It has appeared on my favorites of mid-year 2022. Then now I need to set my makeup and this collection has this new gorgeous peach blossom silk powder. You have seen me using this powder before. It is gorgeous. The thing that I love about this powder is that it doesn't contain talc and as many other products from Florasis, it has floral ingredients, botanical ingredients that are very, very soothing. Inside the powder, you find a little puff and this powder is very finely milled, but it really doesn't change that shade of your concealer or foundation. By the way, I will be leaving all the details of the products that I'm using today on the description box below. As per usual, along with their links, just making sure that nothing is creasing before setting it. And I love to use the puff. It's just an easy powder to go ahead and take it on the go for sure. Just put it on your purse and that's it. So lovely. It does have like a little bit of sheen there's no shimmer, but it kind of has that reflection of a pearl, which I find it to be just lovely. I'm going to use a brush, and I'm just going to go with the powder and dust it around, since I'm going to go next with bronzer, blush, and whatnot. I'm going to use this face palette from Florasis. This has appeared on, again, my favorite of 2022 mid-year and if you're new here to my channel welcome welcome to all of you my dear friends i do feel me natural light so hopefully this will give you always the best representation on how the products look if you were looking at them in person i'm gonna go ahead and go to the contour shade and if you tap a little bit on the blush you can warm it up a little that way if you don't want it to be really too much of a contour shade and you want to bronze up your skin it will give some warmth to it. Going for the blush. And next to the highlighter. Love how soft and ethereal it is. It's not harsh, it's not too beaming, it's delicate. This collection comes with two eyeshadow palettes Bright in Sunrise and Mermaid in Moonlight. Love the beautiful packaging. It looks kind of like a book, like a little book. Very lovely. And it opens up like such a little cover there's so many details just let's be reminded that susan fang is that designer and here is the palette and then at the bottom you will find let me show it to you because this is exciting to me to see all these amount of details going on on a collection there is a beautiful necklace look at that with a little pearl because this collection is also inspired by the beauty of the pearls which are to be said that they represent eternal love so each of the palettes comes with one of these necklaces so pretty dainty delicate 
with a little pearl. The first palette is Bright in Sunrise. And these eyeshadows, they do have different finishes from matte shades, satin, topper shades. If you were to see them in person, they are just like exquisite. There's some glistening on this shade that is just, oh my goodness, so pretty. And they do come with a mirror too. The next palette is called Mermaid in Moonlight. And this is even more ethereal. It has more of like very light lavender tones. This textured kind of shade that looks just like crackle crystals. So pretty. So beautiful. Look at that. Such a beautiful palette. Very, very ethereal. Just go ahead and swatch them both. And then each of them, they do come with a dual brush. They don't have the sponges at the end. They are both brushes. Oh, they feel so soft. This palette, Mermaid in Moonlight, has three matte shades and then again this stunning topper shade. The mattes are extremely soft and silky. Oh. You see how much it reflects this shade? It looks like your eyes will be wet. I cannot wait to use it. I think I'm gonna use a combination of both eyeshadow palettes. Going first with this shade. And I'm gonna take it a little bit clean. Going next with this kind of like bronze taupey shade. And I'm gonna apply it on the outer of me. I love how thin is the formulation of Florasis. It's creamy, not a cream, it's a powder, but they do have so many emollients that are very, very easy on the eyelids. Mostly, if you have, I do have what is considered mature skin, experienced skin, I'm over 40 years old. And, you know, I do have fine lines signs of aging, my skin on my eyelids, they are not as firm as they used to be before. I really appreciate formulations that are not super thick, but that they deliver pigment and that they have emollients because that helps a lot on the application, how they wear. Such a beautiful, beautiful formula. I'm going to take this beautiful lilac shade and I'm going to take it right on the crease just to bring a little bit of that lavender tone and I'm taking it above the crease and just softly blurring the edges Going next with this shade, and I'm going to apply it from the inner corner all the way until it ends with the glossy tone. Wow. I'm sure this is kind of more of like a sheer kind of eyeshadow. There's no fallout. Very ethereal. You can actually put it over top of any of these shades and it will just add a little bit of that romantic glistening effect. Now, I'm just so curious, friends. You know myself. <laughs> I need to go with this shade. I need to. 
Well, I want to. <laughs> it's just so pretty. It's just intense. Wow. And I'm applying it just with my finger, tapping it right on the center of the eyelid. It's fantastic. This is not duochrome, but it does have so much texture in a good way. Texture that is not crumbly. Texture in terms of how reflective it is. That it adds so much shine to the eyelids, but without being too much. Going back to this palette, and I'm going to take this shade, and I'm going to just apply it on my lower lash line. I'm going to go with a denser brush and I'm just going to pick up this shade and this will give a more intense application and again applying it on that outer third of the lower lash line but very a lot more closer to the lash line and this way it just will give a little bit more intensity I went ahead and applied some mascara, liner, and now going back to this palette, I'm going to go to the lightest shade. And I'm going to take this shade and just apply it right here on the inner corner. And also on the brow. This collection also comes with two lipsticks, you know, friends. The lipsticks from Florasis, they are stunning from packaging to formulation and you have to see this beautiful design. Look at this. Oh my goodness. This is gorgeous. It's all brocade and it does have the reflection of the pearl. Oh. And then the little pearl charm. Stunning. I have here the shade 521. Basically press on the top where is the lock. And then it releases from the bottom. Nothing short of impressive. Works of art. Honestly, they are. This is a gorgeous kind of like pinky coral tone. And then the other shade is 520. And this one is more of like a rusty kind of shade. Now that fall is coming, and these are on the matte formulation. I'm going to go with the shade 521. I'm building it slowly. To balance out the look of the eyes of the look. Mm. Love this shade. And I love how soft it goes. It doesn't look too much. I mean, I didn't even have to line my lips. And it just looks perfect with this look and here you go my friends this is the final look using this new collection by florasis i think it's very soft ethereal definitely ideal for everyday kind of makeup you don't necessarily need to use the topper shade you could just go simple and it will give you a very sophisticated look love the lipstick because it's not it does have pigment but it doesn't make your lips look like too harsh too much it just makes it look very very lady very ladylike 
love these new products from Florasis. And again, thank you once again to Florasis for partnering up with me on today's video. Again, I will be leaving all the details of this collection, the links, absolutely everything will be on the description box below. And now my friends, I would love to know from you which of the products from this collection you're most attracted of, which other products from Florasis you have already tried. Let's just continue the conversation on the comment section down below while you're at it. And if you haven't done so yet, I would invite you to subscribe to my channel. Make sure you ring that post notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads and come and follow me on my Instagram. If you like this video, do not forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, share it with family and friends. And until the next time, I hope you have a beautiful, wonderful day. Bye!